Eating better is easier with cool produce grown right here in Mzanzi. Just color your plate with two fruits and three veggies every day. Cool Uzotwala. These five South Africans are ready to show off their cooking skills to impress the judges and win big to become Zansi's next cooking star. Fresh produce grown right here in Mzansi. Hi, we've got you. Eating better starts with cool five a day. Just add two fruits and three veggies to your daily meals. As we said to make eating better easier, color your plate with cool. Contestants, well done on making it this far. Give yourselves a warm round of applause. My name is Tabisa Lelaka. I am from Joburg. I work in sales. I am a mom. I am a big cooking enthusiast. My name is President Ndaga. I'm a 23-year-old boy from Pumalanga. My name is Pumelelo Maisela. I was born and bred in Limbobo. Currently, I'm studying tourism and hospitality. I'm Lisa Lowe. I'm from Coast River. I'm a mom of two boys and a happily married wife. I love cooking. That is another one of my greatest passions. I'm Alicia Thomas and I'm from Durban. I'm 30 years old and I love to cook. For this week's challenge, you'll each have one hour to create a colorful, balanced plate of food using today's hero ingredient. Yes, and for the first time in the competition, it's not a fruit or a vegetable. Today, you'll be hearing Koo's new range of pulchets. That's right. Not only does Koo offer you five-a-day options, but affordable potent sauces too, like pilchards, which is a great source of omega-3 fatty acids. And guys, it's not just about the meat. As a vegetarian, I'll be looking at how you incorporate that five a day on your plate. At the end of the day, only one of you can go through to the grand finale. And to help us decide, let's meet today's five a day superstar. My name is Ima Adams. Ja, ek is gewoonlik as ek aanbieder en a judge, maar vandag is a ander type talent. Omdat ek so baie kinder sê, Kijk hier naar beter manieren en goedkoop manieren hoe een mens beter tussen kan doen. En dis hoe kom ek hier is vandag. En die belangrijkste ding is, ek wil eerst vloekie nie, maar het moet lekker pro, het kan nie mm, pro nie. So die is vir die talente, net om vir een bykie te inspireer. Ek gaan jou hartstrare raak. Ek hoop dat dit affecteer jou smaak. Alles is te doen met een kleine bykie koe. Dit klink absurd, maar jy doen dit met pultje. Please welcome Imo Adams. Yeah. How's it? How's it? And pleasure meeting all of you here today. Guys, as a teen, I grew up eating pilchards, and I've got four kids now, and I want them to have the same experience. So I'm quite excited to see what you guys are going to be dishing up. To get inspired, we've created a special dish using pilchards as the hero ingredient. Imo, please do the honors. Hey, oh. wow. There you have it, pulchets prepared in a contemporary way. Here we have beautiful pulchet pot stickers. It's basically a dumpling. In this case, we've used wonton wrappers filled with pulchets, mushrooms, spring onions, garlic, ginger, and some cream cheese. Ima, you want to give it a try there? Can I? Can yeah. I? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, okay. Then it's first steamed and then fried in a pan. And we've added some toasted sesame seeds to it as well. And underneath there's a dipping sauce with spring onions, soya sauce, a bit of garlic again, and then just decorate it with some chili and coriander. What do you guys think? Delicious, eh? Pretty expensive, but it's so easy to make. We want to see five unique plates of food and make sure they have balance. And I'll be looking very closely at those veggies. Behind me is a fully stocked pantry. And you'll notice today we've removed all the meats because the only protein you can use is pulchards. You'll each have one and a half minutes to gather your ingredients. You'll go in one at a time to adhere to social distancing. Once the time is up, the pantry will be off limits. Are you guys ready? Yes! Let's do this. Tabisi, are you ready for your pantry dash? I am. Yes. 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 You have one and a half minutes on the clock. I hope you know what you're getting because I'm very excited. Your time starts in three, two, one, go. 
I've always loved cooking. I grew up in a family that cooks a lot. I got teased a lot for always frying everything, the sizzling and popping oil. So I decided, you know what? I'm gonna show these people and I'm gonna learn how to cook. And today, I'm the best cook in my family. I'm sorry, you guys. I'll get some lettuce. You go it, move it. Avo. Avo is always good. Um. Say fata paki, eat yalka raki. I can't even deal. I have to remind you, you're now currently standing on one minute. My love for cooking comes from my late mom. She was a cook, and everything that I know, I've learned from her. Ooh, I saw her taking two breadies. I think I might know what you're doing. Some spices. Spices. Ooh, it's got bread. It's got I don't know what I'm doing. Alicia, there is 20 seconds on the clock. Pumi, you are making me nervous. Move, grab anything. Ooh, I'm so worried for you. The ingredients like a bit of min. I don't know if you're very funny, but it's a bit of min. Ten seconds on the clock and counting. Five, four, three, two, one. Liesl, set that mic in here. Come okay. on, put it down. You know, I was a little bit nervous, so I was somewhere, somehow I forgot some of my ingredients. Contestants, today's about pearl charts. You've gathered all your ingredients, now the pantry is off limits. And today we want to see lots of creativity on your plates. And for your convenience, the cool will be available all throughout the challenge. Can I see some excitement in here? Yeah. Yeah. So guys, please be great, ready, steady, and colour your plate. More colour on your plate means more wholesome benefits. So turn your meals into a balanced plate with cool five a day. Eat better and stand a chance to win 5,000 rand daily. Buy any three cool products, dial star 120 star 1987 hash or WhatsApp cool five a day to 072 741 5357 and follow the prompts to enter. Cool Uzoqual. Introduce new cool pilches as part of your five a day meal. It's high in omega 3 for heart wellness. Cool Uzoqual. Ready, steady, and color your plate. My love for cooking started with my mother. I'm just putting my little twist on it now. For me, it's all about flavor and diversity and coming up with new and exciting dishes. Lizzo, what you cooking? So I'm making a infused poached fish cake yes. on a sami with some fish coleslaw. Yep. But as long as the infuse doesn't taste confused. Okay. <laughs> Another concern that I have is that it's a bread. I eat bread. For who? Just in case. I mean, everyone saw. Just in case. Okay. All of the best. Thank you. I see. I really like the fact that they didn't really have a choice today in terms of the proteins. They all have to use pilchards. Mm -hmm. So we're going to really see how you know creative they going to be in terms of bringing that pilchard flavors in there. And we're seeing lots of veggies. Mm, I'm a happy girl today. I'm going to eat my veggies. I see a lot of colour. I think we are, we're in for a treat. Yeah. My love for cooking started when I was young. Yeah, I used to stay with my father, so I spent a lot of time at work, so I had to cook for myself when he's not around and also prepare some food for him, so that's where I gained the passion for cooking. Um, I just want to check what's in the spot, man, because it looks like something is cooking. <laughs> just water. Wow. <laughs> hot water. <laughs> you can't go wrong with hot water. Can you let him know what you'll be doing for us? I'll be doing a stew. A stew? Yeah, with salt chips? Yes, with salt okay. chips. So I see some curry powder as well. You're going to add that in there yeah. too? You're going to get going, man. <laughs> All, the okay, All the best. All the best. You only have 40 minutes on the clock. Let's do this. I love cooking, I like trying on new dishes, and it's because of my sons and my husband, basically. My husband is adventurous, he eats anything and everything, and he loves trying new things. So I'm always trying to impress. Listen, you never left Durban. Yes. It's the first time. You're gonna bring some of the Durban flavor. Definitely. <laughs> I cook with pilchers at least once a week. When I was growing up, my mum cooked it very often. It was a staple in our home. I'm going to use the hot pilchers because I like the spice in a bunny. How are you taking the pilchers and making it special? I'm braising it. Right. Spicy. I'm going to put it into a bunny 
and serve it with some nice sambals. Old school. Bunny, you feel confident with that Absolutely. <laughs> half an hour to go, guys. Keep going, good people. It's half an hour to go. I would call myself the 30-minute queen. I do quick meals, I do nutritious meals, I do tasty meals, and I always give it a twist. Is everything going according to plan so far? Going according to plan, just not, not a lot of time. No, nope. I like her energy, Ruben. Mm, I, I love it. I love it. Like she knows. Have you been doing this before? Ah, uh, yeah, I have. Mm. So uh, let us know what uh, you're preparing for us. I am doing a cottage pie today. Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. But I am going to pair it with salad, with pear and chickpeas, and other interesting things. And it smells right. great. And it, it smells does. great. Thank you. Guys, make sure you've got everything. You can't afford any mistakes at this point of the game. 20 minutes ago, guys. My memory of Pilchard is in high school. I was in boarding school. So most of the time, we're just eating canned food. Take out the bones and then we mix with mayonnaise and maybe acha and then we just eat. How are you going to incorporate your Pilchards into your dish? I'm going to add Pilchards into my, my pasta. Oh, oh okay. okay, okay. I like where this is going. Listen, all of the best. Thank you. Uh, don't be nervous, you're doing great. Thank you. Imo, isn't it fantastic to see just how everyone is really just giving our hero ingredient just a special touch? Mm. I mean, cottage pie over there, we've got the bunny chow going, some spikes, mm. but they need to get a move on it. No, because... yeah, time. Time is of the essence. Right. Yeah, it's very hectic. Everyone is running around. You don't even know what you're doing at this point. Ten minutes to go, guys. You better start thinking of plating. Still see some stuff in the oven. Listen, ten minutes is not a lot of time. I'm loving what I'm seeing. Is it? You just have to sprinkle that last bit of... Yes. Oh, is that going to go? Dicey, oh, right? That's just going to give it the crunch. Uh, <laughs> Ruben, Sippy look as cool as a cucumber. So calm, with almost five minutes to go. What? Eh? Um, I'm waiting for my star. She's still in the oven. Star of the show is in the oven. Yes. My stress levels right now are just through the roof. I'm so anxious. Okay, guys, time's running up. Make sure you get everything on that plate. Less than 10 seconds to go. We currently okay. at five, five, four, four three, three, two, two one. one. Everybody step away from their plates. Well done, guys. It smells delicious. Mm. Give yourselves a warm round of applause. Well yeah. done. Introduce new Koo Pilches as part of your five-a-day meal. It's high in omega-3 for heart wellness. Koo, uzotwala. There was a lot of fun happening in the kitchen. A lot of pressure, but I think they managed to pull it together. And today's uh, hero ingredient is Koo's range of pilches. Mm, yeah, and I mean, we saw a really nice variety of dishes. Absolutely. I just want to start tasting them. <laughs> I can't wait. Well, let's have the first dish then. I'm happy with my place. If I could, I still wouldn't do anything differently. It came out perfect. Ooh, Ooh what have you made for us, darling? OK, I made a Durban traditional bunny, but I put a twist to it and I replaced it with poachers. With egg, I fried corn and I threw it on the top and served it with sambals. Mm. I like nice, it. Nice, Alicia. I hope you'll enjoy it. Thank Thanks, you. Eh? Thank, you. Thank you. I've done my best to impress the judges. I put my heart in that plate. Okay, so I saw you took the top part of the bread and left me with a corsi. I like the lid, man. <laughs> no, I like the lid too. That's the problem that we're dealing with here. Say, too late to stop now. So. For the next meal. I'll, I'll Can I have a lid? <laughs> <laughs> I love the curry. It's quite spicy, mm. but the flavour for me is there. And she cut the bread a little bit shorter. Yeah, yeah. It was kind of like more comfortable to eat. The corn worked. The salsa may be too chunky. Other than that, loads of flavour. Generally, it was a well-composed and well-cooked dish for me. I didn't like it, so <laughs> I have to eat more to make sure that I don't like it. So I just want to make sure that I don't like it. <laughs> Mm, okay, I like it. Good. Yeah. We can have the next dish. Oh, yeah. 
can a little bit nervous. What about the judge will think about the dish? The biggest mistake that I've done is forgetting my ingredients and not having enough of all of them. Present, also gain. Okay, here I've prepared a pilcha stew with rice and goes along with a summer salad. Okay, the smiles is coming through, man. I hope <laughs> it translates to the dish. Yeah, I'm glad that I give it a try. Done my best on it, so I think they will like it, of course. I, I don't know. Yeah. I'm not getting the, the stars not kicking through for me and um, I mean that's mixed with beans as well so that's almost overtaking the actual star of the meal. Whatever he did to this dish, he took away from the star of the dish. I just find the rice so bland um, mm. and there's so much you can do with rice and season it and give it flavour. But I'm giving you effort for you know, including the veggies in the rice, you know? Yeah, I agree. The pulchard flavour doesn't come through enough. Too many peppers again for me, because yeah. uh, that kind of overpowers the flavour of the pulchards again. Let's taste the next one. I haven't been this nervous before. My stomach is in knots. I'm just questioning myself right now. Orapeti. Kidreje kasi spike or spaghetti, taganele fishies, taganele di veg. This is kikasi velem. <laughs> Thank you. That is so nerve wracking to know that this well known judges are going to taste my dish. I am so nervous. I actually liked it. I loved it. Um, the bucatini and the pilchas together with the chakalaka as well and the, just the finish of the cheese on top. And I quite like that she created a refreshing salad right. just to bring lightness into this dish. For right. me, it was cooked perfectly. Yeah, I miss the pulchard flavour and maybe have a little bit more cheese. Because the pulchard is undercover. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> Spikos, come on. <laughs> I am so nervous right now. The best chefs, a nutritionist, and Miss Batsitana Kumalo are about to have my food. Oh my goodness, I could collapse. Kaja cook a pile a cottage pie with pilchards and I have a salad with chickpeas and pear. Oh, it sounds amazing. I don't even know. Even the presentation, you're the only person that puts more plate in a plate. <laughs> Come, on. Come on. I hope they can appreciate the love and effort I put into that meal. As much as there's a lot more I wish I could have done, but I did cook it with love and I hope that comes through. Wow. Listen, Tebi brought her A game. Mm. I mean the presentation, um, even just the dressing. I'm lost for words. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know what to say. I mean, what do you say after such a really great plate of food? I mean, everything is there. It's a bochi on a bochi on a bochi. <laughs> this is the right amount of everything for me. You have to go on your sort of, uh, the first impression when you see it really looked good. In terms of flavor balance this time around, the amount of the mash and the filling inside was just perfect. The only thing is obviously, I think there should have been more maybe color and a bit of crunch uh, on the top because what what you want is to also take it to the next level. You no. can see it actually started here. I disagree. Really? I suga wena. That in my tummy, that is all that matters. It's lekker. Lekker. Your lekker is lekker. My lekker is lekker. I'll stay. Next plate? Yeah, let's try yeah. the next one. Let's do that. Presenting a plate of food to these judges, I'm so nervous. Liesl, can you tell us what are you presenting us with? Today I've made for you a pilchards infused fish cake mm. on a crispy bruschetta with an avocado salad and pecanite. Whoa. I like it when you talk foreign. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just praying that the flavours and the taste is good enough. I know what it's supposed to be, but it didn't. That's... It's kind of dry. It's not like there's. it needs a bit of juiciness. Um, I can't put my feet. Even on the salad, there isn't any dressing. There isn't actually. any dressing. I must say, for me though, it's it's a variation of the fish cake I haven't had before. Right. And somehow I quite like it. <sighs> also, the baked beans that were added mm. actually really complemented the pictures nicely. I know it's not quite where it needed to be, but it's a variation 
I think the, enjoy it. We would have enjoyed it mm. if there was some moisture there. Absolutely. And, you know. She could have really just made an effort with, with the salad dressing. Mm. Yeah, I agree. What we needed was a saucy element. Well, we had some interesting dishes today. Winning this would be the best birthday gift ever. Yeah, I'm just hoping for the best. That's all I can say. I can't. I'm shaking. Jitters are having me. I'm spiraling. I just, I just want to know already. All the best, guys, and may the best cook win. You guys did a fantastic job today. They gave you a challenge, but I think you guys rose to the occasion. Give yourselves a round of applause. Your dish was just beautiful. Your cottage pie uh, could have just become a little bit more golden brown, but I think you ran out of time to put it into the oven yes, earlier on. President, thank you so much for your dish. Your food was lacquer, it had taste to it. For me, presentation is always key. Yeah, thank you. Pumi, what's up again? Your spirals inspired past the bake. I am very monat, monat monat. Hello. Mara, happy very good guy. Happy very timelete ka ara past and nar nyaka happy enti ya Yes, but totally inspired, really. Hello. Lizel, ek was gewarit. Vanas was baie brood. Wat sê gevarit? Dit was. But I cannot fault your plate. Looked fantastic. Your presentation, you always have Quite. Very nice. Thank you so much. Elisha, your first time out of Derbs to come and show us how to make a pulchered bunny. It was delicious. But was it good enough? You all did a fantastic job, but it came down to two contestants. Seppi and Elisha. Under the cloche is the winning plate. Imo, will you do the honors? And the winning plate is... Seppi! <laughs> Thank you so much. Seppi, well done. Your dish was just, just delicious. It was light but full of flavour. And as the winner of this week's challenge, you walk away with a hamper worth more than 4,000 rand, including Le Creuset kitchenware, a Nutribullet, and cool products. And you've colored your plate to the finale. Thank you. Yay! <laughs> winner, winner, pilchard dinner. Today was crazy. Everybody was good, so I can't even imagine how it's going to be like in the finale. I'm so excited. Next time on Color Your Plates with Koo, five brand new and excited contestants battle it out to earn a spot in the grand finale. And joining the judging panel is Mzansi's favorite television presenter and business entrepreneur, Maps Maponyani. The best way to color your plate is to enjoy three vegetables daily. Eating better is so much easier with Koo Uzo Dwala.